Okay, welcome back. Uh, Cheetah MS800 In-Depth Programming Part 2. We're going to look at programming a more complicated patch, number 25. You can see the left and right channels. There's a bit of movement going on there. And it's made up of three different tones. So one... 77 and 78. So, starting with tone 71, how do we actually program that? Well, it's made up of five waveforms and we have to put them together into a sequence which makes a tone. So, the first thing we do is choose the start volume and the first waveform, which is number two. And then we want to change to another waveform. We've got waveform four, and the 99 is uh, the time crossfade, and it's about 99 equates to about 1.6 seconds. So we've jumped again to form five, same crossfade time, waveform zero, same crossfade time. Our final waveform is waveform one. And then we create a loop, and in this case it's loop round to parameter 5 until I take a finger off the note, stop playing a note, and then jump to parameter 19 for the release phase, which is here, and the green signifies we've got a volume change and it's dropping down to zero in about one second or so, and then 99 signifies end of tone. Okay, so tone number two, which is 77. Again, made up of five different waveforms. Through them, starting off with 29. It's not on the official list. Then on to 1, 9, 14, and 4. And looping round and release phase. looking form. And finally tone 78 which is made up of four waveforms because the first one is actually blank so we start off with silence and then we move into waveform 44, waveform 6, 29 and finishing with 5. And notice the volume Positions, the crossfade is different, so there's a little bit more movement on this waveform. It's a little bit more irregular, and then we've got the fade out. Three waveforms, three tones, should I say, and we're going to program them to make a patch. So the first thing is in the patch programmer we say this is going to take three tones. The tone number one which is the output left or right. The detune, what velocity curve we want, to change the volume at all. Transpose semitones or octaves and rather bizarrely at the bottom we choose which tone which is 77. This in tone we, we've got an output on the right hand side, a little bit of detune, same velocity, a slightly different volume, no transpose, and tone number 78. And the third one, we have an output on the left hand side, a little bit of detune, velocity the same, volume very similar, no transpose, and this time tone 71. And put it all together, and this is what we have. <laughs> So this is just an example of a more complicated tone using 40 different parameters. A of a patch that uses 14 tones 
84 parameters. So you've got to sit down beforehand and work out exactly what you want. There's no just sort of twiddling a few dials and knobs. You've got to think carefully, plan it all out, program it all in, and then press enter and see what it sounds like. So left side of the brain, right side of the brain, it's certainly not for everybody. A um, bit challenging, but it's definitely different from your normal synth. Thank you.